Hello and welcome to the Historian Crafts Podcast. My name is Raina. You can find me on Instagram and Ravelry under SF Chick. Today is Wednesday, February 20th, 2019. It's about 11.30 in the morning. Um, I'm recording a little bit early because I won't be home this weekend. I am going to a knitting retreat on Saturday, and Sunday will be my errand day, because usually Saturday's my errand day, and Sunday's my down day. So, I thought that I would talk to you today, and it's really snowing outside, we're in the middle of a snowstorm, so um, I hope that you're nice and toasty. And have your cup of coffee. And why don't we get into my knitting. So the first um, project I have is a finished object. This is for my best friend Natalie. I've been working on this the past few weeks. Um, sorry my phone rang. It, um, this is. The Three Color Cashmere Cow by Hohi Locatelli, sold out of Nip Picks, Hawthorne, and Brown, and Teal, and Gold. And then you see the lace, and this part, and you will... Um, I, I will give this to Natalie when I see her next month. I am going to the Pittsburgh Knit and Crochet Festival in Green Tree, Pennsylvania. And um, we're taking a class. Me and her, we're taking a class with Heather Zapetti on steaking. So I got to do my swatch for that class, but it, I don't have any non superwash yarn yet. <clears throat> I have to order some. I have, I have, a, I have some in a cart that I need to get, and when Friday comes, I can I can order that. The second project that I am working on is a um, three color cashmere cow for my friend Krista. I promised her she's a really good person, and I wanted to make one for her. She has a green coat that she wears in the winter so I think that this would look really fabulous so this is storyteller yarn that I'm making the first band out of and then this is Ba La Jolla blueberry lemonade and I keep them in my bags like this so I can I don't get my yarns twisted but um, I'll take this out and show you. This is Bala Hoya in the um, Blueberry Lemonade colorway. And this is going to be the second color. The third color is a Neighborhood Fiber Company um, skein that is upstairs. It's a tonal. It's out of the Parkland colorway that they use to raise money for Parkland shooting victims in Florida last year. So there's that, and um, other things that have been going on. I <sighs> Cal School is merging next year, so he's going to a new building. And it's not that far for, away from where I live. So, um, he's, he's going to a new school and he likes his new school. And we were excited. I was excited to take him to see it. And, um, they're closing, they're closing his, his current school at the end of the year. But, um. And then <clears throat> he decided that he wanted to be baptized Catholic. 
so he is going to be baptized on Easter Sunday. My um, mother's good friend from college, who's known me since I was eight years old, is going to be his godmother. Her name is Joni. She, um, she's been through everything with us. You know, the high school and college and she was at our wedding and our Kellen's first birthday party and she never my friends never forget my son when they also like send me something so I'm going to make her another three color cashmere cow <laughs> but I um I was going to work on them in tandem but I think that would drive me a little crazy and um so hers is going to be out of purples it's up there on the shelf. I don't want to get it right now, but hers is, Joni looks really good in purple. She looks like Betty Boop, and she, look, and she looks really good in purple, so I'm going to make her one. And um, I decided that when I do the striping on the cow, the next cow that I'm going to do, I'm going to do the striping a little bit different. Instead of two by two um, ribbing, I think I'm going to do two by two by three ribbing. If you see the computer shake, that is because the cat is right next to the monitor, is right next to the computer, and she's rubbing it. Because hello, mommy's talking. I she has to um, <clears throat> she has to. Be present where mommy is. And um, so this weekend, my mother-in-law found a retreat a couple months ago in a newsletter from her church. So we are going up to Camp Hill, which is like an hour away, I want to say. It's an hour away from here. And um, where they... they where they're going to have mass and they're going to um, have, an, have knitting going on and it's going to be catered and I'm really looking forward to it because before Graham moved up, moved up here we were really close. She's like my knitting buddy. Every time that I am have a knitting tobacco now I go to my mother-in-law. She helped me weave the ends in on Natalie's cow. And um, so I need to pick, I need to be cautious in what I pick to take with me because I don't want to be, I don't want to be antisocial and saying that I really need to concentrate on this pattern. And there's one of those upstairs. So, um, I was thinking that maybe if I get through my increases on that pattern, then maybe Saturday I can, you know, maybe Saturday someone will be nice enough to assist me. I know my mother-in-law will, but um, it's always it's always good to learn tips and tricks from other um, knitters. And I was going to start a pair of socks, but I have two socks on the needles. And that I, one, I just got past the German short row heel. And the other one, I um, need to make my German short row heel. So, that's what I'm going to do today. Because it's heavily snowing and I just let the dogs out to go to do their business and usually I just um, stand at the front door while they go out and do their business and I walk I walk out a little bit but I didn't have my shoes on and it's it's probably about like four inches of snow outside already so they just went and they did their quick thing and they came back in, and Fifi, 
Fifi is a red labradoodle, and she looks so cute covered in snow. It's like, come on, Fiona. She had snow on her nose. I love it when dogs have snow on their nose. But I'm rambling, 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 rambling. So anyway, I had a, I had a, uh, an appointment this morning. I had to cancel because of the snowstorm, and I'm glad that I did. And I had another appointment this week that I went to. I've been having really, really bad stomach cramping. And they thought that it was maybe my, my um, birth control method. So I switched. I didn't switch to another one. I just had them take that out and um, we'll see we'll see how it works but um, anyway I hope that you are good and I hope that I will see you in a couple weeks I am so sorry that this is short lived and um, I think 10 minutes I try to go 20 minutes but 12 minutes is better than 6 minutes when I try to rush th through things. So, anyway, I hope that you are good. I hope that you are happy with your knitting. And, and enjoy. I'll talk to you in a couple weeks. Bye-bye.